What's up fellas, tonight we're gonna try and replicate my TMAX125 uh, tracker So uh, basically everything on this bike is homemade except for the paint because my friend did that for me The seat, the cowl is from a uh, Rosy Classic 250 uh, I hand saw the... I used the hand saw to remove the, the end bit to make it look shorter because if you don't it's not gonna look right with a team with a TMX one two five. It's gonna be too long and doesn't go with the shape. So the paint is a uh, olive olive green, light olive green. Uh, the signal lights are uh, bullet grilled signal lights. I have a twin uh, circle brake lights at the back. Tires are Pirelli. The engine is painted black. The exhaust I kept the exhaust stuck because uh, on long drives having a loud exhaust is actually a bit painful in the ear so I drove from Cavite to Baguio before and uh, about three times already and it just it's just uh, doesn't sound right having a really noisy exhaust so uh, the handlebars are from a Fino, a Yamaha Fino and the side mirrors are stuck so We're gonna go right ahead and start with the stock uh, TMX. First off, for me, I always change the tires first because it's uh, most expensive. So I choose a Pirelli because uh, for a tracker build, Pirellis are, I think, the most affordable and one of the best uh, performing uh, performing tires uh, right now for me. Just for me. That's for me. So Pirelli tires. Uh, in real life, you can't really use this uh, this kind of size because it's gonna touch the it's gonna hit the fork. So maybe use a hundred, only a hundred for the for the for the front front bit, or you can change the fork to a bigger fork so you can fit bigger sizes like maybe one ten. It's gonna look a lot bigger. We're gonna go ahead and remove the seats. For this, you can do at home. Uh, remove the seats, tidy up the wires, and then just hand use a hand saw to uh, remove this front bit, and then sandpaper, and then maybe paint it a little bit to uh, prevent rusting. For the U band, you can buy this U band on Lazada for seven hundred pesos, and for the installment, maybe just pay for the labor, maybe two pieces of uh, welding rod and. The electricity that's it if you have a friend who can weld then that's even better because you can try it yourself for the seats we have two options we have the normal ones from a local upholstery shop or anywhere and the second one is a Rusi classic seat with the cowl so for the first one this is a really easy to come by maybe just pay 600 or 700 pesos with a flat sheet, uh, some foam, and some uh, synthetic leather. So for the for the that's for the first options because if you don't have a friend who doesn't have a spare Rosy Classic uh, parts, it's really hard to find. So right now we we have it red. We're gonna change the color later. When I said earlier that I cut off this front bit, make sure that if you cut if you do the same, make sure that you put a, a metal bracket on the inside and bolt uh, each each side of the cowl together on the steel bracket to make it look to, to close the gap because uh, if you don't it's gonna be too wide unnecessary, unnecessary space it doesn't look good so if you cut this part off make sure to uh, bolt the each side of the cowl together to make it uh, go closer it's gonna look even better so if you cut it off, it's gonna look like that. We're gonna go back to my motorcycle. There. So, so far, we have the seats, the wheels, and we're gonna move on to the headlight. So, we're gonna remove the headlight and replace it with a headlight that you can buy from from Lazada. Uh, it's uh, It costs like uh, around 1,200. It, it already has a built-in uh, grills it's like they're actually thick so it's 
I think it's gonna the glass is gonna survive a longer uh, duration of time because because of uh, the built-in uh, headlight grills it's it looks nice it's affordable I think it's uh, one of the best options uh, for me because the size is actually uh, perfect for the for, for a TMX 125 Alpha for the handlebars we're gonna remove it and replace it with uh, uh, stock stock Keyway Cafe Racer 152 handlebars where you can buy you can buy online you can buy from a friend if you have a friend who uh, swapped out his handlebar then make, maybe you can buy that for let's say 400 to 500 pesos fair price for a friend um, this one's actually my handlebar I just uh, cut it off and paste it on this uh, TMX so with the handlebar done we're gonna go ahead and remove remove the paint the red paint from the cowl and we're gonna paint it matte black with the tank so it's gonna look like this after a uh, piece of advice for those beginners who's trying to start building their bikes make sure if you see something nice but uh, you're not sure if it, it's not gonna look if, if it's gonna look good on your motorcycle don't buy it make sure be patient and wait for the item that you ordered online and be patient it's gonna it's gonna do you very good at the end so we're gonna uh, next part is we're gonna remove the side covers on my motorcycle I just uh, tied I I moved the side covers here at home I tied the the battery with using a rubber rubber holder for the battery as well and I uh, uh, put like a couple of uh, tie wraps like uh, one two three four five like six pieces it's kind of overdone but it's gonna do the job it's not gonna fall off it's gonna it's not gonna wiggle or move so I think it's uh, it's it's fair not that uh, the best looking but it's, it's still nice so for the stickers there you go Honda so if you compare it on, on my motorcycle it's kinda close not so much because of the the headlight bracket it's different I got that from a friend so I don't know how much uh, it cost on Lazada or from Facebook so there you go TMX 125 Alpha for the brake brake lights I have t twin twin circle brake lights uh, maybe 450 each um, the grills the, I mean the signal lights are bullet signal lights with the grills uh what do you call this again um saddle circle tool bag or saddle bag i got a homemade uh, grill from i just uh there's a broken fridge at the back and i took out the trays where you put the food and i just used that to make a make a headlight grill so white white thermal wraps and white uh, aftermarket shock absorbers this actually this only cost like 1k on on any local motorcycle shops so I think that's pretty much it uh, let's try and compare it again I'm actually starting to think this black one is uh, better better looking it's more tidy so that's it guys TMX uh, 125 Alpha Tracker if you remove the handlebars and replace it with a clip-on handlebar, it's it's gonna it's gonna be a cafe racer uh, because I think that's what defines the motorcycle, the, a tracker in a cafe racer, or because of the handlebars. So that's it, guys. Uh, if you like this build, feel free to uh, uh, do the same or replicate it. It's a, uh, it's uh, I'd actually be, uh, be proud if you uh, do the same. If you like to build, uh, ask some questions for more information. Um, if you wanna suggest a build for the next video, comment it down below and like and subscribe. Subscribe, guys, please. I'll see you in the next video.